Hey, Tommy, I wanted you to kind of get a whole glance of this. We refreshed this part of it and just stayed with the old green and white. This part is very old. Jim is in the process of considering remodeling two rooms, making one a uh, master bath and obviously one either a kitchen or an extra bedroom. And as we walk around here to the front, this hasn't been painted in, I don't know, well, we've been here quite a while, so we're on our seventh year. And again, this is just the big windows that go all the way up and the faded green and white. It's so bad. It really, we've, we've got to really do this. But our goal is to change it and drama dramatically and, and create more of a, a provincial Provence look because of what we... Obviously, your favorite comment of this is ridiculous view. So the grapevines and all of that will always stay. And around here, um, Jim, <laughs> he almost fell off the roof, crazy guy. So the question is, you know, do we de-beard this whole thing or do we leave the beard? Consider this the entrance, consider this the entrance and freshen it up in a, a really beautiful you know, kind of that fantastic lavender light framework around the window sills. You know, that beautiful color that we so often admire in French architecture and of course in the south of France and all the rest. And then the decision on what we do with the white because the white isn't going to work with that and it has to be a color that would be typical. And then we just keep the gray slate floor because we had that redone. It's kind of interesting. It picks up a little bit of lavender at this particular time in the night. So, uh, yeah, I see the lavender. I see whatever that other color is. And, of course, the great view. And here's Jackie O. And here's Nancy Chuda. Big kiss to you both and a happy belated birthday. And get your butts up here. Okay.